Number eight on the QR code review is asking us to divide this polynomial by that polynomial. So a couple things to remember. Um, number one, this is called your dividend. Uh, this is the one that goes inside underneath your, uh, I almost said square root, underneath your um, division symbol. Uh, this is your divisor. Um, and that goes on the outside. And I'm also noticing that the dividend is not written in standard form because I do not have an x squared term. I jump down from x to the third all the way to x. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert an x uh, squared term. So here we go, x squared plus three divide, we're gonna write underneath my dividend here. I'm gonna do a two x cubed. Now I don't have an x squared, so I'm gonna put a zero x squared. You wanna have a placeholder in there uh, in case you need it to line up your x squared terms. Uh, plus a four X and then a minus one. Okay, and then this process, this, this long procedure is really all it is, it's just a procedure. So X squared times what gives you two X cubed. So I think the answer would be two X because two X times X squared is two X to the third. And now you go two X times three, that's six X. Where do I put that? I put that over here. That's a positive six X. And then we are going to subtract everything from here and see where we end up. So this is zero by design. Zero x squared minus nothing is just a zero x squared. So I'll just write it down if I want to. Four x minus six x is negative two x and then bring down your minus one. All right, so will x squared go into zero x squared? It'll go zero times. But if I play this out, I'm just gonna have this as my remainder. So my remainder is just negative two x minus one. But the correct way to actually write this thing, it would be, um, the answer is uh, 2x uh, minus 2x minus one over x squared plus three. So it's basically the remainder divided by uh, your divisor. So either one of these will be fine. If you write it on the test, you can leave it like this, or you can leave it like this. But if you're doing your homework and checking, the book will probably give you this answer and you're not doing anything wrong. Okay, that's how you do number eight.